What's up, rap potential YouTubers? I just realized that, uh, well, I've been doing work and not filming, so I gotta get back to filming. So, first off, somebody else I want you to meet, Letty, come here. This is Letty, like Letty from Fast and Furious, the new shop dog, slash rat ranch dog to hang out with. She's a mix of all sorts of stuff. She's very cute, very smart, adopted her from the Humane Society. Pretty pumped. Got a friend now. So, in addition to all of you guys that are following this channel, you can now follow the dog. She does not have her own Instagram because I don't have time for that. So, unless she figures out how to run a smartphone, which you never know, she is pretty smart, then we're not. So, what are we doing tonight? Anyways, rap potential videos. Y'all are here for cars and stuff, not dogs. Well, I was getting ready to pressure wash this. As you can see, I kind of started. And uh, I wanted to show you guys before. So, this is the engine bay for this uh, 12A that I've been building, which or am going to build, which is over here. I'm probably going to stack it tomorrow. I finally have everything back from that. So all the parts clean, everything's laid out, ready to go. Rotors, housings, new stationary gear bearings, the whole deal. If you watch the other video. So that's going on. But this is the car, and the engine bay was a mess. So I doused it with some purple power and some degreaser and getting her cleaned up. And I'm going to make a huge mess in my shop, but in the end it cleans it. And uh, I'm going to pressure wash this thing. And the dog's probably going to freak out and just go sit over there in front of the fan. So, anyways, let's get to it. Alright, well the dog's not entirely afraid of the pressure washer, but um, oh, you may not be able to tell much of a difference, but it looks pretty good. It's not perfect, but better than it was. Um, and I'm not, you know, I didn't get hired to clean the engine bay or to paint the engine bay. I'm just here to rebuild the engine to make the car run, so do want to make sure it's clean before we put it back together, but um, it's looking pretty good. That side looks nice now. I don't know what this like coating stuff is. The car's originally from uh, Philadelphia, so Pennsylvania. They do all sorts of weird stuff up there. Um, with this like undercoat stuff, the yellow stuff. So, with that, I'm going to, uh, I guess, since I got these a little bit wet, I'm probably going to have to douse these with some more WD. So, to kind of run through things, here's what we got. We got bearings in the stationary gears, all these parts are cleaned, all these parts are cleaned, rotors, housings, these housings are much better conditioned than the other ones, so those are fresh, irons are still good, all cleaned up, painted, ready to go, uh, got some assembly lube, there's the old housings there, rebuild parts and seals, so tomorrow, um, I guess we're gonna try to stack this motor up, which I think should be pretty cool. What? I'm sorry, I was making noise there, dog. So, and then over here, I still need to clean up the eccentric shaft, make sure it is just clean and spotless and ready to go. And I also need to clean and paint the oil pan. So that I'll probably pressure wash off here in a second. Dry it, wire reel it, clean it. Same with the water pump, which is in good shape. Um, it's just a little dirty old coolant so the dog didn't get it and I need to clean that intake manifold so this will probably go um, get degrees get all get all the gunk off of it make it look nice so that uh, when this thing goes back together it looks pretty good he wants to uh, paint the car when it runs good and everything so if it's all good and running then he's gonna have somebody paint it which honestly could be good could be bad some of the body shops around here may not do it the justice it needs He's owned the car for 
a long time he has. So just kind of fixing up. The interior is like minty red. Super nice. So it's only been off the road for like five years, so it shouldn't be too much of a of a haul to get the fuel system up and going. The brakes work fine, transmission shifts into gears fine, like that sort of thing. Starter works good, so just a little low compression and a carb rebuild. So with that, we'll call that the 12A project car update. And uh, I got a dog. Yeah, talking about you. So, thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching us on the Rad YouTube channel, the Rad Potential YouTube channel. And uh, this is where, you know, we take some rad stuff that has great potential and make it freaking awesome. So, like and subscribe if you want to see more sick rotary content or at least stuff that I would watch. So, if you like what I watch, then watch this. Thanks. Keep it rad.